Greetings everyone, my name is Addervale, and welcome to my let's try of the demo of Witchfall Secrets of Emotica, a 2D action platformer in development by Bacon Fish Games. All set. There he was, the mighty king of Witchfall, <laughs> standing tall and true defying all the monsters who dared to surround him. However, as powerful as the king was, even he knew that he was outnumbered. Huh? What? Just when all hope seemed lost, who should appear? Why, the ever-faithful and loyal champion to his majesty, of course! Who was this brave sorceress? Her name was... Call me? Huh? Call me! Huh? What? <laughs> <laughs> Call me? Who are you talking to? Oh, I see. Playing hero again, huh? <laughs> You'd best get ready. The master wants to see you. I didn't do it. Huh? Oh, <laughs> no, silly. You're not in trouble this time. He wants to see you and the others. Come on, shake your tail. Jumpin' Jojo's! Maybe he has a mission for us! Welcome, Bacon Fish. Find all three portal glyphs. Always begin the journey by running to the left. How to jump off of platforms. Yes, we are. Uh -huh. I'm afraid so. We just collected a bunch of them. <laughs> yeah. Sounds like a plan, Fowler. Wow, look at the sprite work and animations. I know I sung the praises on Oroscope's sprite work and animations, but this easily rivals that. If anything, this is even more vibrant than that game. All of them collected. Hang on a sec. Now let's talk with ya. Master Fala. If anything... Sure, why not? We need their glyph. Don't blame me when they get blamboozled. Right, I got an air dash. I should be using that more. Look how bouncy the animations are. They are super bouncy and expressive. Watch out for falling platforms. They'll do a little shake before falling. Uh -huh. 
Here you go. Enjoy your early lunch. Flying clock. Oh, look at the moon. Look at the moon switch. I see. But I haven't collected all the fruit yet. Who is that bouncing in the background? I still have a hundred fruits left to collect. Jassy! <laughs> Look at her character portrait. It's both goofy and adorable. Alright. When Komi's out of power, she cannot use her wand or broomstick. It's back here. Portal's now open. Just one measly fruit left. Ah, here it is. I will note, however, there are fewer individual frames of animation, compared to Oroscope, that is. The portal to the school has been opened. Let's go! Boss time? Defeat the mysterious figure, Arcanum. Sonny, this has gotten more serious. Didn't mean to hug you. With 1 HP to spare. Got them all. V for victory. Ah, This marks the end of the demo. I was hoping for one more stage. But I suppose this shall suffice. In the final game, I'll have access to 5 different playable characters. Frenchie! I recognize her from several servers. Feel free to link the Steam page because...
This demo is also a joy to play. Honda is a collectible, so keep you coming back. Can you find all the character and monster cards? We'll see about that. Would you like to try a time trial? I'm going to try the time trial to see what's going to do. Find five clocks. Would you look at that? Stratoscruffy! He's in the background! This has been your daily dose of Freaks cameos. I need those blocks. So, dispatching enemies reduces the time left. Not time I've left, time I spent. Anything you have to say? I'm going to screen cap the screen. Uh, I'm curious, what species is Komi? Komi is a cat, specifically a Scottish fold. Good to know. Mission complete. My apologies if I keep making this comparison, but I think Aurascape's demo is a bit better, namely as it has more content. However, what is on display here is nothing short but joyful. The sprite work and animations and overall aesthetics are very vibrant and expressive. Special mention goes to how bouncy all the characters are. And the music supports the aesthetics as well. The gameplay Although being a bit more on the simplistic side for now because, hey, this is the tutorial stage, it sets a good foundation to be expanded upon. This may be the Sonic Amateur Games Expo, but there are a few games featured here which clearly don't look amateurish, and this is one of them. Let's hope that the final game sticks the landing. In any case, great job developer. I'm certainly keeping an eye on this title, and I wish the best of luck to you. Well then... Thanks for watching, and have a nice day.